On February 22nd, WVU fans were seeing quadruple as four hopefuls competed to become WVU's newest Mountaineer. For West Virginia natives Ethan Ball and Troy Clemens, being the Mountaineer represents much more than just the university. When you're the Mountaineer, you carry the whole state on your shoulders. And I'm so thankful for everything that West Virginia has given to me, so I just want to be the one who represents uh, this great place. I think this is a great state and they deserve a representative who's going to put their passion and pride out on the court and out into the community as much as they can and in the best way that they can. The four finalists were selected based on an application, essay, and interview, and selected by a committee of faculty, staff, and students. The winner of this competition will be named the 64th Mountaineer in WVU history. Amongst their responsibilities are to attend every home game for each team and rile up crowds just like this one. And while being the Mountaineer certainly is a big responsibility, finalists Savannah Lusk and Aaron Cox are ready for the task. You, you get the opportunity to represent the passion and the tenacity and the love that resides here in this state. I've never wanted something as bad as this and uh, I've worked so hard to get here uh, and I'm just going to keep on trying every year. The winner will be announced March 2nd during the WVU men's basketball game versus Texas Tech. For ESPNU Campus Connection, I'm Jordan Kramer. For the first time in six years, Mountaineer signing day was relatively drama free, due in big part to the players already on the team. When we bring all these guys here, uh, our players play a big role in, in, in helping recruit these guys. And help they did as West Virginia football got several top junior college recruits, as well as two of ESPN's top 300. The Mountaineer signed a total of 27 new players, including nine who are already enrolled at WVU. But don't expect Holgerson to say who he thinks will be amongst the best next season. You get you get the questions, coach, who's your, your top two guys? You know, I, I, that's just so hard to answer because you're, you're going to probably set the kid up for failure because you're going to be wrong. While Holgerson might not be picking favorites, that doesn't stop fans from stating who they're excited to see out on the gridiron. I'm pretty pumped to see Kaiser White. Uh, Kevin White's my favorite, but I think Kaiser is the youngest and he'll be one of the best. Steven Smothers because he's from Maryland. I played against him in high school and yeah, he was a dog when I played against him, so I hope he does good here. Uh, I was really excited to see that they um, recruited Kevin and Karan's little brother. As excited as they are, Mountaineer fans will have to wait until September 3rd to see most of the new recruits in action. 